Hello again, this is Paul Frankel over at Sculptera. Today we're doing two things in the vineyard. These are two things that are highly important to the overall taste and the quality of the fruit. What we're doing first is we're taking away leaves on the morning side of the canopy. We go through and pull all the leaves right on the fruit zone, exposing the fruit to the sun and uh, wind and uh, airflow. Doing this early is highly crucial today. Is the, is early part of June is usually when we start this and we start with the with the hilltop grapes which break bud first have more clusters early on the second part is we drop fruit which seems like you're taking away your fruit and you're taking away a uh, possibility of making lots of wine but this increases the uh, quality of the wine a tremendous amount we what we're doing is we're leaving one cluster on each, each shoot right now um, that will enable the vine to get that cluster ripe very, very easily. And it also keeps the clusters from being close together, from growing into one another, getting each cluster room to grow all around. These clusters of Grenache are so big, so heavy, they can weigh upwards of a pound as we're taking away uh, the earring, is what we call it, the part of the cluster that branches off from the top. So the, once again, the vine will only have to focus on getting that main part of, of the cluster ripe. Uh, also, as, as you look through the vineyard, as you look at the before and after shot, when you, when you look before, you see tons of fruit all joined up together. When you look at it afterwards, now you see a more, much more balanced vine, fruit hanging in its own space, enabling the crop to get ripe early. And this is one of the last, the last parts, actually. From here on, we'll just monitor the fruit, uh, keep everything clean and healthy, and uh, wait till the harvest comes. So, thank you for watching.